Hey everybody, welcome back to Body Pal Picking. I'm a part-time picker and eBay reseller and it's time to go over everything that sold this week. New Wave Pro Plus infrared ovens are making me some big money right now. I sold one a week and a half ago and I sold another one brand new in the box, paid $25 for it up front, but it sold for $95 plus shipping within 24 hours. In fact, I've got a third one sitting in my death pile that I just picked up yesterday. So like I said, New Wave Pro Plus infrared ovens making me some cha-ching. I got several printers for just a dollar from Goodwill's Dollar Days. This one is an HP 6500A, all-in-one fax, scanner, copier, machine, printer, all that good jazz. I listed it for $50 on all platforms and I sold within two hours on Facebook Marketplace local pickup for $50. That's a dollar into 50. I love those margins. I used to think that the Salt Life brand was a thing of the past and I don't normally pick it up anymore. Picked this up about six or seven months ago and listed it during the summer. It finally sold on Facebook Marketplace for $20 plus shipping. I only paid seven bucks. I paid up for it. I don't know why, but I'm glad it's gone. Recently picked up this Tommy Bahama Island Zone polo shirt. Brand new with tags. Original price $110. I paid $5. It was still there on half price week, so they originally wanted 10, half price, five bucks. It sold within two days for $39.95 plus shipping. It's a size 3XL, and that's why I think it sold so quickly. Nintendo Wii Rock Band set with pedal, no sticks, USB. That means no additional dongle necessary. A friend of mine said that he didn't want to take it home because he didn't have the means of testing it properly. So, I did. I got a Nintendo Wii. I plugged it up. Worked just great. Paid $11 and it sold within three days for $45 plus shipping. Sold a pair of HyperX Cloud Stinger Core headphones or a gaming headset for PC gamers or, or whatever the case may be. Xbox, Sony, PlayStation. I actually sold these from my son's closet when he got a new pair for Christmas and he got this pair a couple of years ago for his birthday, so I'm into this for nothing and I sold them for $19.95 plus shipping. They're practically brand new. I even checked around the ear uh, supports and they're really, really clean. He did a good job of not messing them up so that we can make some money off of it. Ink is always a great pickup if the price is right. It sells quick and it sells easy. This Canon ink numbers 2020, 220 and 221, brand new, in the pack, sealed. I paid $12.99 for two packs of ink and a printer. So that's like $4.60, $4.30 something cents a piece. But I sold both of these to two different sellers in one day, $29.95 free shipping. I honestly have no idea how long I've had these sandals, but they are keen sandals, leather. They're for kids. I don't even remember how much I bought them for, but they're very clean. I know I wouldn't have spent more than $10 on them. Hopefully I only spent five, maybe six, because they sold for $24.95 plus shipping. A few months ago, my Goodwill started Dollar Day, and anything of the specific color was just $1. Picked up this ink for just a dollar. Thought it would sell for around 30 bucks, but it finally sold today for $19.95 free shipping. It'll cost a little bit, but again, I only paid a dollar for it. Speaking of Dollar Day, I picked up a couple of different printers, all for $1 each. This particular printer, it's a Canon Pixma, very good shape, TR4520. Great condition, it works, I tested it like a charm. And it sold today for $39.95 plus shipping. A dollar into 40, man, I love flips like that. I hope you took some notes and you enjoyed this video. I'm gonna start doing sales videos like this on a weekly basis. If you like this type of content, hit the subscribe button and give me a thumbs up and you won't miss the next one. Thanks for hanging out with me. Y'all stay safe out there and have fun picking.